We have done this super fast animation video using Speed Paint and we got a lot of comments that says it's not working and what what and what what. One of the comments that I want to answer today is it's not working that we're going to do another one together. The other one that we got was how can I incorporate the Speed Paint on a video ad or on a product ad so that I can advertise my product. This video that we're doing today is going to cover that. Recently, we did a video for Danny Madanzo Mo's podcast. And the video is advertising the podcast to say that it is out, it's available. And we created this using Speed Paint for the podcast. The launch of the podcast got like 1.2 views. Let's jump in on Canva and create this podcast intro together and answer some of these questions we have. The first question we are answering is you got an error message to say that the image that you've added is not suitable. Most of the time you've used an image where you've converted it from an AI or you've changed it using the old triple app or you've just used an image that the software does not recognize. That means you need to change the image Add a new clearer image that the software can use and then you are able to generate the video. The second question is there's no color on the video. The output of your video is based on the selection that you make when you're creating the actual animation. So if you've added your image and the software is happy with the image and you scroll down you choose the frames per second once you get to the section that says color fill duration and you leave it as zero color fill, you're telling the software that it shouldn't complete a color on your video. That's why our output shows as no color. So it's very important to pick the correct options for the correct outcomes. This video that we did selected zero color fill. That's why it's a three seconds long and there is no color. On the output of the video. On this next example, we're going to choose the color fill to be five seconds and then we'll see how the outcome looks like. So when you're making your choices, it's very important to pick the correct options that you want. If you don't want color, then it will not fill color. Then it will say the app is not working. And if you choose five second color fill, it looks like this. The next question was, does it work on a free account? So what I've done, I've logged in on my free account on Canva and I'm gonna open a blank canvas and we're going to go and do the speak paint together now. Once you've opened it up, you're going to scroll down to your apps and you're going to find Speed Paint. And then I'm going to choose an image. I'm going to pick the same image we're using and I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to make 30 frames per second. The duration of the sketch, I want it to be 10 seconds. And the color fill duration, I want it to be 10 seconds and I do want the add sketching hand and the fade out effect at the end. So I'm gonna click on animate. Awesomeness, the video has been uploaded. So we're gonna right click and we're gonna set it as a background. And it's 48 seconds long because of the choices that we've made. On the tool itself. So when we play it, it's speed paint based on and it starts filling in the color. 
because of the choices that you've made on the tool itself. And this is on a free account. The last question we are answering is, how can I incorporate the speed paint to my design in order for me to advertise my product? You can add it into a video like we did here. So the, the trick here is to add music. To add nice transitions. way that it zooms in and zooms out and adding different slides that talk to whatever it is that you want to achieve with the trailer at the edge that you would like. If you enjoy these kinds of tutorial and you want more animation, you can go and watch this playlist. We also have a course on Udemy that you can go and buy that's currently on special. Thank you so much for joining me today. I will see you on our next video.